So last year I had an attempt at filming a clip with the Nokia N73, the fabled Finnish juggernaut, or at least that's what I called it. Uh, sadly that endeavor didn't work so well because the phone itself was a bit defective. Well, that's a bit of an understatement. Anyway, I'm nothing if not resolute, so in my staunch and relentless maddening um, a search for uh, weird, quirky, obsolete tech stuff, I, I stumbled across not one, but three Nokia N73. <laughs> so I paid 12 euros for the, these things and I got, uh, well, they're currently uh, disassembled because I've tested the whole lot of them. I have the back plates here the well the battery covers rather and i have also two batteries right here so i paid 12 euros for these things and well hopefully some of them will be working well actually i know which ones will be working this one has a cracked screen this one is the better looking of the trio, but it doesn't start. And this one, well, sadly, the worst looking of the bunch is actually functional. Uh, conse consequently, I have charged up the battery, well, one of them anyway, the better looking one. And it seems to be working just fine. So let me just uh, put on the better looking um, back plate I believe this is the one and just turn it on and see what happens right so what you heard there is the famous Nokia intro tune which along with the Nokia tune uh, for calls is one of the most memorable uh, sounds of my generation. <laughs> okay, so I'm not going to be spending too much time explaining to you what this thing is because it was the go-to phone. Actually, it was kind of the compact uh, premium device of its generation. Think... Uh, S23 from Samsung or iPhone 13 or whatever you get the idea so it was quite expensive I remember at one point of well for us Romanians anyway it was around 300 euros and that was through shady deals and gray market imports or rather I don't know unofficial uh, purchases of the device what I would like to see is whether the camera works and if it the well the mechanical party trick of this phone is functional meaning if you remove if you slide this uh, a lid here the camera should start right up let's see if that works yes it does indeedy but I don't know if the camera itself works so let me just wait for a bit. No, it works and it's supposed to have autofocus. At least that's what I remember. I think it took a picture, but I have to uh, pause a bit and try to get it on the screen. Okay, so just a fun quirk for you out there. There's also a secondary camera and I apologize for my appearance, but I just prepared this video to film while just to film the phones in my hands. So the background and my appearance don't look so good. Anyway, I just wanted to show you what it can do and to check out the camera samples. So, all joking aside, I do think this camera can take uh, incredible pictures, at least for its day, well, which was 2006. Kind of interesting to, um, to see that because uh, also in 2006, touchscreens like this HTC Touch Dual were beginning to show their dominance and conquering the market. So, the new Kia was kind of out of its uh, going out uh, to pasture or at least this classic uh, Q5 
keyboard phone, though the pictures themselves don't look half bad. By the way, this is an autofocus camera and the result, as previously stated, is quite, uh, quite nice. So anyway, the phone itself, this example is a bit rough around the edges, the central push button here is missing as compared to this phone. The front bezel is all uh, scratched and the paint is peeled off. This one is looking better, but this one, but it's not perfect either. So let me show you that. So I don't know what I would need to do with these two phones is to try to disassemble this one and to uh, move this front housing with the keyboard to the functioning one and well keep it in my collection for um, well for future uh, showing which I will do right now. And with these two, what I need to do is just throw them into the pit of doom. But anyway, this has been a brief revisit of the Nokia N73. If you want to see my original clip from last year, I, um, I will put a link right here. I uh, hope you have enjoyed this and Please like and subscribe because I'm going through my old quirky phone budget pretty, well, pretty loosely and I paid for these things 12 euros, uh, money which I will never see back, unfortunately. Um, it, I don't know, I don't feel like selling them, it, sh it, look, it l might look like a ripoff and well, until I make money from this YouTube endeavor, I'll be on a tight budget. Anyway, thanks for watching and remember, I buy, own, hoard and collect weird, quirky and obsolete tech stuff like this handful of Nokia N73s so you don't have to. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one. Bye bye.